Want the ability to capture what's seen on your iOS or Android device? Today I'm going to be giving you my full review of Reflector 2, an application available for Windows and Mac for $14.99. So Reflector 2 allows you to capture what is displayed on your iOS or Android devices, such as an iPad, iPhone or Galaxy S6, just to name a few. And this is a great way to show off a new app or game and share it with your friends or the world to see. So how does Reflector 2 achieve this? Well the app uses Apple's AirPlay technology and Android's Chromecast feature, allowing you to stream the particular device to a PC or Mac using a wireless router which needs to be connected to the same network as your device. Connecting your iOS device is pretty straightforward, assuming you are connected to the same wireless network as your PC or Mac. Slide up from the bottom of your iPad or iPhone and select AirPlay. At this point you should have the option to connect to your computer. Usually it's indicated as the system username. Note you'll also need to enable screen mirroring. You'll notice now that the application will now show the iOS device correctly. It's a little different on Android however. Firstly you'll need to head over to the Google Play Store and download the official Chromecast app which is free. Then you'll need to launch the app and go to the free bar icon on the left side menu and tap on cast screen. Here the app will ask you which device to stream on, of course you'll want to select your PC or Mac. Once connected you should see your Android device on your PC or Mac correctly. Within the application itself you have a few options. Clicking on the reflected 2 icon will present the quick connect menu. Here you can adjust the style format of the device you are using, toggle full screen, enable an external microphone for voiceovers and even attach a webcam. Diving deeper into the preferences menu, here you have the options to change the name of your PC displayed name, enable or disable always on top mode, resolution options and connection rates as well as recording modes for support up to 4K recordings. When a device is connected, I found the preview to be displayed laggy and found that it did seem to drop frames. In my testing I tried two different wireless AC routers, the PC was also connected through a CAT6 cable. However, while I tried an iPad 3rd generation as well as an iPad Air Mini, I found that there was still drop in frame rates. Android devices were not as bad, however it still wasn't perfect. What's strange was that I didn't face this issue while viewing the recorded footage from Reflected 2. This may have been something to do with buffering. The footage was very smooth, however I did notice that while recording longer clips of 5-10 to 10 minutes long, the application would take a considerable amount of time to export even on a good spec PC. So what are my thoughts on Reflected 2? I think that this application offers at its core the ability to record screencasts easy and effortlessly and while the frame drops still exist at least in my research and testing, I would still recommend this application to people who are looking to do app reviews, showcases and more. There is only one other way of doing this and it would require a purchase of a capture card and other accessories, but that's when we're talking hundreds of dollars and I couldn't really recommend that to someone over an application that costs $14.99 which basically does the same thing. So that's going to wrap it up for this review of Reflected 2. Just a special thanks to Air Squirrels for sending me a copy of this application for review. So let me know in the comments below what you think about Reflector 2 and if you yourself have used it. If you guys enjoyed this video be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more tech content. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.